for tuning in to this great channel, Dr. Mary Mugo. This is where we inspire you. This is where we positively affect your lives, the lives of the people around you, the lives of the society. This is where we educate you on various issues. Hey, thank God we are in December 2020. This year has not been very easy for many of us, right? This year, many people have lost their lives, people have lost their jobs, people have lost their businesses. Yeah? Other businesses have made losses, others have closed down. But guess what? Amidst all these challenges, there is something that you can thank God for. There is something about 2020 that you can thank God for. Because you know what? The good book says that a living dog is better than a dead lion. Yeah. The fact that you are alive today, it means that you are valuable. It means that you can rise again. Many things that you can thank God for. Ever heard of the song? Eh? Count your blessings one by one. And you're asking me, hey, Daktari, what can I say I have gained this year? What can I thank God for this year? Many things that you can thank God for. God has healed you. God has protected you. God has provided for you, yeah? You have survived an accident. You've driven the whole year. You've never had an accident. That is God. Yeah. And you've been moving around. You've never caught corona. It's not because you have a mask. No. It is not because you sanitize so well. It is by God's grace and mercy. Yeah. You can thank God for many reasons. A story is told about a man who was complaining to God that he did not have shoes until he discovered there's someone who had shoes but no legs. Yeah? Thank God you have legs. Thank God you can hear me. Thank God you can see me. Thank God you can smell. Thank God you can taste. Yeah? Thank God that you can wear shoes. There are many things that you can thank God for. And if you think there is nothing about what I've said, thank God that you are alive. Yeah? Because you can breathe. Yeah? You can eat. You can go to the loo. Hey, you know there are some things that people take for granted. There are people who are in hospital today. There are people who are struggling today because they cannot go to the loo. Yes, thank God that you can. What am I saying? There's a lot you can thank God for. There is hope for you. The fact that you are alive today, there is hope for you. There is hope for your business. Because the good book says what? That even though a tree is cut, it will sprout again. Yes, you will make it. You will rise again. Yeah? Your business will rise again. Your family will rise again. Because there is hope for you. Thank God you are alive today. Thank the people that have contributed positively to your life. Visit a children's home. Help the needy. Help the disadvantaged. Because all that you have is truly God's grace and God's mercy. Hey, I came to tell you today, you will rise again. I came to tell you today, there is hope for you. There is hope for your business. There is hope you will get a job. There is hope your tomorrow is better than your today. Because guess what? That is the truth of the matter. Mm. 
Like this video, share this video, and subscribe. God bless you. There is hope for you. You will rise again. Are you looking for a consultant, a trainer, or a motivational speaker? Well, look no further. Our team is competent in implementing team building and training programs for various clients. We work with you to identify your needs, assess your employees' skills design, and implement the most appropriate approach to deliver. Our approach is founded on a well-thought process, including a post-training phase and evaluation phase to assess the training. We are experts in team building, motivation talks, and matters of leadership and strategy. Call us and see the difference.